Yo, what is up? Jay here, and I am bringing you this semifinals of the MLG tournament recently online, and I have not played in one of these in quite a little bit. Um, I was looking at it. I saw that they were having one. I think this was Wednesday-ish, Thursday-ish, and I was looking at how many people are in it. There's only like eight people, and I was like, all right, that ain't worth my time because you're not gonna, you might win like maybe like 50 to 80 dollars with eight people in it. I'm not exactly sure on the payout because they only pay out at like 50 to 60 percent, so it's definitely not 100 percent worth your money. But I saw Serious Mo was in the tournament, and I won again versus Serious Mo. And if you don't know who he is, he's arguably the best tournament Madden player in the scene and I've never played him so I wanted a game versus him and in this game I have the Cardinals I'm playing this wolf guy 82 v 5 4 3 2 1 he's the Chiefs and he's running this I form pro offense and oh my god it's something it's like an offense that I kind of I, it's, it's something stupid like I would run and it was a little frustrating but I felt like I should have been locking this up better than I am and as you can see, he's taking his little taking his little yards little by little, these fourth and inches. And I have QBD, and I have QB sneak defense. I don't know what happened there. And then delay again. Anyways, we're going down seven nothing, and we're we're not we're not liking the situation that we're in, my friends. We're not. And I have not played regular teams too much in this game. And so I was like, all right, we'll pick the Cardinals. I'm not really worried about offense. Defense is kind of what I want. And I was I was kind of thinking, I know face catching is abused in this game. And I figured, you know, Pat Peek, Marty on the art side, we're not going to have to worry about too much face catching. And as you can see, I, I probably should have been the 49ers. Have a little bit of hip hop, but we ain't worried. We got Ellington. We're going to the outside, my friends. We're going to the outside. And then here, do a little play action over the middle. He's, he's user in that guy. So we just check down. If that would have got picked, I would have been sick. And then we fumble. Oh, my God. But he goes out of bounds. And then here we're going to a little trio offset over the middle. And then we challenge his user. And we get Floyd. I don't know what hell Floyd that is. Malcolm Floyd. Whatever. And here we're now we're giving it to Ellington back up the middle. And we're taking our little yardage. Taking our little yardage. The one thing I don't like about these tournaments is you're allowed to. I'm not a big fan of custom playbooks. My playbook is basically Oakland and Carolina put together. But I also have that bunch in there. And there we get the face catch with Larry Fitzgerald, big TD, and we're tied the game 7-7, and we're hoping he doesn't run out the time right here and score last second, but we'll see. And then here on the first play, we get a good run stop, and we're happy with that. One thing I'm, I didn't think I should have been giving up these type of runs that I was running, and then there, oh my god, <laughs> why did he drop that? That could have been a pick six and end the ball game, but we finally got him in shotgun, and you know what we got? We got A gaps. Oh, and then he, we're gonna, what are we gonna do again? Same exact play. And we get the safety, my friends. Yes, my friends. And we're going up 9 7. And we score here before half. We're, we got, we, we GG no re is what I like to say. GG no re. And I'm under the impression I'm not trying to do anything stupid because I know I'm getting ball at half. And I'm just basically gonna say, I'm gonna take my three points. I'm gonna take my three points here. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure he switched. He got whatever defense he's running off the bat. He's totally out of it. He's in this quarters defense. And then, uh, 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 oh my god, I fumble. And then look at this shit. Jesus fucking Christ. Jesus fucking Christ. And then there he tries to face catch me. I never usually go for. I don't know what it is. There's like a type of face catch you can go for where they're gonna. Um, the ball's always overthrown. Anyway, so we're up 10 7. Whatever. Whatever. And we're going to this drive, and now we're just running the ball. We're like, all right, he's playing this past homo defense going through the fumble, and I was like, all right, I'm just gonna run the ball. The one thing about I haven't ran much pistol bunch at all in this year's game. Oh, I forgot to edit that part out. Okay, you guys are fine with me for doing that. You'll get by. And then, but you know, we're like, all right, these are all good run plays. Well, let's keep keep abusing these runs. When I look back at this, I wish I would have went to single back tight, but it's whatever. Oh my god, I forgot to edit out two clips. All right. Well, anyways, fuck it. Now we're running an HB screen. I'm trying to think how did this go. Oh, we get it. Oh, he read that. So we're going to go to third and eight right here. And I got A open. Do I go to him? No, I was looking for the deep route. I remember that play. I don't know. Uh, he locked that up. That's that's like my go-to play in long down situations. Here, we go to my next long play situation play. And we get Ted Ginn over the middle. 
and we're back in business, baby. And then here I'm going, he's user, and I'm getting him off the block shed really well, and I don't know what's going on. And I'm thinking in my head right now, this guy's never beaten me. I've played him a few times, and there I don't know what I'm doing running on the receiver screen. I know there has to be a, a maximum of three guys on the side for it to work. If there's four. I don't know why I ran it. But anyways, we're up 12-10. And basically, we want him to score quick, quick, or we want to stop it. And then there, I was in the right defense. That guy who made the tackle right there should have been there to stop that pass. And then here it's like, motherfucking, just fall down already, Jamal Charles. What are you doing? And he's running this power iPhone. I just, and then there's me having just scared to make an attack. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm, I'm on full tilt, my friends. I'm on full tilt. And there he's running it up the middle. And he's running this power O play, and he's getting his four yards out of crack. I guess you can't complain. Running it again. This time we blow it up over the middle. I can't believe I'm in a ball. Somebody running this type of offense is actually in a game with me. I just. I don't know. This is the worst semifinal game I've ever been a part of. And they look. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Second and four. Can we get a stop? Finally, the running play I'm running gets the pressure I want because he shouldn't be getting this. And then they're third and five. I'm like, oh, he takes a seven. Fuck. Well, folks, we got the epic music. And when we got the epic music, something epic could be happening. And I'm just like, dude. He's running this. This coverage defense. Buck sweep has been known to get me some long touchdowns in this year's game. You guys might think Buck Sweep's dead. It ain't dead. You just got to know how to hit the hole. And then I'm looking at that, and I'm like, all right, run counter. Run counter. Motherfucker, it didn't work. Well, anyways, okay, so now we're going to go. We're going to do a little Buck Sweep. And then there, I, oh, I could have maybe cut that up, but I didn't want a chance of not getting the first down. So we get another first and 10 there. I just take the check down. I could have probably thrown that to Fitzgerald. We're not worrying about it. And then there, I run the screen, and... There was some potential there, one more block to make, and I might have ran that for a touchdown. Now we're running the HD trap over the, it up the middle, and we're driving, folks. We're liking what we're seeing. Basically, I'm just trying to get to the 30-yard line, and I'm going to be in position to make some plays. And then here we just wanted the first down. He goes down. We got 22 seconds there. This was, oh my god, I had R. I, when I was editing that, I was freaking out. I had R over the middle. And then there I have this play just for this, and I was like... Why was it wide open? You're supposed to play the tight end. I'm like, fuck it. How we score our first touchdown, folks? We're going to Larry Fitzgerald. And does he get it? <gasps> he doesn't get the fucking animation. Oh my God. Oh my God. Now we're on fourth and six. We're like, fuck it. We're just gonna do it again. And then I realize all my number, all my receivers are out. So I'm like, fuck. All right. We're gonna throw a quick out route. Ted Ginn get the first down and pray. Larry Fitzgerald's back in. And then Ted Ginn fucking falls on the one yard line and bounce! Motherfucking fuck, 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 fuck. Oh, I'm rage quitting. Fuck this guy. He's a bomb. He finally beat me after five years. I fucking suck. Subscribe. Goodbye.